we are willing to set up uh, special economic zones that will employ uh, these uh, refugees. Now, when you do that, not only are you giving the refugee the sense of economic self-sufficiency, which will lower the cost of hosting refugees, but you also give him skills and training that he will put to good use once he returns to his country. So in a sense, you're incubating a post-war Syrian economy across the border in Jordan that will kickstart the recovery uh, process in Syria once the conflict ends. And that is really critical. And the alternative is actually quite frightening. The alternative is for these refugees to continue living in poor living conditions, to languish in, in dependency, uh, to make, become vulnerable to recruitment. So what we're talking about is a real paradigm shift from short-term crisis relief thinking to more holistic, sustainable approaches uh, uh, and a new blueprint for dealing with refugee issues.